Aloha from Honolulu, where the San Diego State Aztecs win the eighth annual Hawaiian Airlines Diamond Head Classic as they pull away from USF to win the championship 62-48 on this Christmas day in Honolulu. A beautiful shot of Diamond Head. And that's how the tournament played out as San Diego State, who knocked off Southern Miss, Tulsa, and USF to win the championship. Along with Dino Gaudio, Roxy Bernstein with you. And a fun weekend of basketball leading up to this Christmas championship game. And San Diego State, Dino, they pulled away from USF to win the championship in the second half. What did you see? Roxy, when you think San Diego State, you think defense. And that was front and center in this game tonight. They came in holding teams of 37% from the field. And that's exactly what they did against a very good USF team. But they set the tournament record for number of threes made with 29. So they were good on both sides of the basketball. Their athletics, athleticism, their size, their length really bothered USF. And they did it without Malik Pope. So uh, outstanding game for San Diego State. And I was really impressed with San Francisco. A young team, seven freshmen, six sophomores. They follow the game plan. They were terrific, terrific. really impressed with them. USF, Utah, Illinois State all go two and one. Here is Southern Miss, the only team that goes home winless. They were knocked off in the seventh place game by the home team, Hawaii, here. And we saw some outstanding performances in this field and a great all tournament team. And th this was fun to watch. And David Collette from Utah, who really emerged for the youths. He really did. He's a strong, physical, low post present. The transfer from Utah State came in and really asserted himself early in this tournament. He was special, Roxy. Deontay Hawkins helped Illinois State to a couple of wins. Well, 6'8", size, 230, has a very diverse offensive game, could score at the rim, can shoot to three, a terrific player in the Missouri Valley Conference. And Charles Midland, a really talented freshman, a career high 18 in the losing effort in the championship game. Th this is a young guy that's going to be a special player because he plays with energy. He, he's very assertive on the offensive end of the floor. And then we're looking at Trey Cal right here. 10 points, five boards today. An outstanding floor game as well. Not a turnover, a couple assists, and uh, was really special for Steve Fisher's team. And Zylan Cheetah, the most outstanding player of the tournament. Of it. Wow, I love his energy, the force with which he plays. Check his athleticism, and he has a diverse offensive, uh, offensive game. He could shoot the three. MVP the tournament, and he deserves to be. And there is the all-tournament team with the most outstanding player for the eighth annual Hawaiian Airlines Diamond Head Classic, and it was their defense that was a story holding USF to 37% shooting in the ball game in this championship game. So San Diego State wins the title, and there they are with the trophy. We'll see you here next year for the ninth annual Hawaiian Airlines Diamond Head Classic with another loaded field as it'll be USC, Miami, part of this great field, also some mid-major power represented with teams like Akron, Davidson, Utah State, New Mexico State, a fun field here in 2017. Yeah, not, not, not a good field next year, a great field with some outstanding coaches, and uh, Hawaii will be a little stronger as well. So the Stan Sheriff Center will see you here next year for the ninth annual Hawaiian Airlines Diamond Hit Classic for Dino Gaudio, Roxy Bernstein, Mele Kalikimaka.